The Indian Space Agency ISRO has announced the successful runway landing of a space plane. This takes India further into its endeavors to build a reusable space vehicle. Our correspondent Siddharth MP sent us this report on the significance of this test. Take a look. At 7 minutes past 7 this morning, Indian Space Agency ISRO performed one of its most complex experiments. ISRO, with the support of India's Defence Research Lab, DRDO, and the Indian Air Force, conducted an autonomous runway landing of a space plane. This space plane, weighing 1.6 tons, was airlifted by the Indian Air Force Chinook helicopter and carried to an altitude of 4.5 kilometers above sea level. Once the conditions were set and ready, the space plane was released mid-air. It had to make use of its onboard systems for navigation, guidance and control. Using these indigenously developed technologies and its own aerodynamic properties, the space plane made a controlled descent and landing on a test runway in southern India at Chitra Durga in Karnataka. The landing was carried out at high speeds of nearly 350 km per hour. The vehicle was unmanned. Hundreds of India's own sophisticated technologies were demonstrated in this successful trial and executed this landing. ISRO says this is the first of its kind experiment in the world. This is a space plane concept that India has been working on for more than a decade and its idea was born nearly two decades ago. This space plane known as RLV TD or reusable launch vehicle technology demonstrator has been developed by ISRO's Vikram Sarabhai Space Center. Weon's Siddharth MP spoke to the director. Our winged reusable launch vehicle, what is the status and how far have we come? So we are trying out different technologies for uh, reuse. So like uh, you can also use inflatable aerodynamic decelerator which we have tried out in a sounding rocket. And then we reduce the from supersonic to subsonic using that. Of course, it was a small mass. Another option is a winged vehicle where we can take it to orbit and be in orbit for a few weeks, do experiments, and come back and land on a runway. So that uh, program project also is uh, approved. Activities are going going on. So our immediate task is to do a landing experiment because uh, the terminal phase as well as the terminal phase energy management flaring and then coming homing onto the landing site is a very very uh, crucial technology that we will be soon uh, demonstrating at uh, Chitradurga. Speaking about the successful runway landing today, ISRO chairman Dr. S. Somananth said that it was a perfect landing meeting all objectives. He congratulated the entire team of Indian scientists for their efforts. Bureau report, we own, world is one. Uh, the